and you're on the metal. So, this tutorial is about copying animation from character to another character inside Unity. So, for example, I have here my character. It, uh, it's rigged and has animations. If you look at this animation, uh, for example, this animation. What I want to do now is copying all these animations to work with this character. Even this character is not even rigged. As you can see it doesn't have wounds so in this method uh, well usually people use Maya with a package called hit IK you're just copying getting a reference character and copying the taking this as a reference and copy to the other character with the rig and simulating everything but it's kind of complicated and has some undesired issues so you may uh, have some uh, weird animations and maybe something weird in the, the part of the body so you wanna just uh, stimulating the poses but it's yeah it's it's kind of hard but it's complicated and hard but yeah it's could work the other method I saw was blender but this is more more much complicated than Maya because you're getting the two animations the two characters and try to simulate one to another so this is takes a long time and it's something like you're doing a, a new animation but in this method you don't really want to rig anything you don't really uh, make any animations you'll be doing anything with simplicity so in this method I'll be using a site called Maxiamo. This site you can go on maxiamo.com and just sign up for it. It's free. And uh, this this site's about like if you have any character you can get it any character from here. And for example, apply any animation. There are here a bunch of animations and you can apply any one of them. Alright, so once you're here, let's discover the site a little bit. So here you have the characters. You can choose any one of them. Let's probably choose this one. So after you choose a character, you have a lot of animations you can choose from. And all work for any character. So all these animations could work with all the characters so the whole idea here is making 3d animation simple but we'll be using this feature is upload character we'll be uploading our character from unity the one that doesn't have any rig so one other really cool feature that Maxiamo has that you can rig your character with, with it and it's too simple so that's why I'm here so let's click next this is for chin this is for rest You can disable use symmetry if you have a problem with it, but I don't. So, after I did this, just click next and wait for it to make the auto rigging. That might take something around two minutes or three. Alright, so once it's done, you can see this animation, it's working with our character, even though we didn't really break sweat using your rig in it. So now you can use any animation you wish, uh, 
work nicely. See? So what I want to do is to download this character with this rig. If you want to, you just click download. But here I have this animation, so I don't want any animations. So I will download it with absolutely no animations. Uh, that's a bonus trick if you want to get animations from Maxemo. It's totally free. It's easy. Just do it and download. I'll be downloading mine as FBX on T-Boost. Let's get our character here. This is the rigged one. So let's rename it because we have another one already called the same. No, we don't need Maxiam anymore, we can close it. And wait Unity to import your character, that should be quick. So here, your character now is having the bones just fine. See? All right, let's delete it for now. Let's first wait for this one animations because we don't have any controller. We can create controller, we can... Let's go ahead and create animations. Or let's rename it. Animation. Controller. Let's create an emission controller. Call it Spear and Alfred. So we have all the animations here inside the VX character. We can choose any. Let's take this one for now. Right. So let's move the camera around so if you have a camera like this and you want it to be pointed where you look at so just click on the camera game object line with view so now we have this so let's run our animation is playing because we have this here right And one thing you could think of is just disabling this, enabling this, getting the same controller, you have the same animation, and just run it, and expecting it to run. However, it won't. Why? Because, let's check for the animations, all the bones actually are missing, because the rig is different. If you look at here, it's called root, it's called and even if you go to scene and see this is root position and this is the root position so everything is wrong however you can do something to fix this go here to the one where it has the animations go to rig so you can go to humanoid and just we'll do the rigging uh, according to unity so we make sure to make both rig as same as each other's and make sure that they doesn't lose any animations so let's try this all right it's applied now you have human uh, humanoid character if you we are creating from this model you can go to the other character, the red one, and do the same. Red humanoid, create from this model, 
standard size so now we have so now we have both rigs should be working good let's test for this animation alright so it's not working let's check why So let's check for here, screen either, it has, why, because we didn't really assign the animation controller, so you can set this back, delete this. So let's just, it's just because this is prefab, so when you change this, this will be changed. So let's get back and get this. And let's run it again. Expect it to work. So it's working fine. So let's try the other character. Alright, let's disable this. Let's get this with the animations. Now if you run this, this is working good. So even they are different from their rig, this is called something like head, this is root, and this still works. Because you you made a unity understand, you made unity like just take this and make your own rig and take this and make your own rig. So Unity now understands that uh, the boons that has uh, this character has and this boons that this character has so now you can move it as you want. So you can do something like this to get fancy. And let's look here in game object align with view. You can do it with Control Shift F, so this is easier to do. So and run now. Now you're having the animations working fine with both. And if you want anything else, even if you want this character to be different than this character can go and create animation controller and call it like the mail model controller now you can just replace this with this and you still can go to the other character here and steal some animations from him so you can steal the item so now we should have two different animations this is idling and this is moving, stopping. Right. So even uh, this is not looping because you can actually fix this with animation if you want. So this is either relaxed, you can go fine. Right. And you can fly. So now this is looping, right, and we forgot to make the idle loop, actually. Which one was it? This is the speed idle. Right. We will turn this. All them. Here I believe this is the one we're looking for. Loop apply. So if we run now, we should have two 
animation move the loop so this loops just fine and two animations are different with the same with different rigs and you didn't even rig anything you didn't copy animations it's all working fine so this is a really good tip 